If I asked you what is something that you've always wanted to do, what would you say? If I asked you, what is something that you've always wanted to do? Maybe you plan on doing it in the future, maybe you've been putting it off. If I asked you what is something that you've always wanted to do, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? I want you to think about it, okay? And I want you to remember that for later on in the video. You know, I've been thinking a lot lately, maybe a little bit too much, but I have came to realize some things, a lot of things. Traveling cross-country was probably one of the best decisions I've ever made. It did more than just enlighten me and inspire me and motivate me to get my life back on track and to live a life that's worth living again. But it also taught me that it's okay to take risks and go on adventures, even maybe when it's not the easiest route to take. Sometimes the easiest route isn't the best route to take. Sometimes it's good to take a risk. I guess what I'm trying to get at is that if I never went on YouTube one day and seen know happen to like stumble across a video just clicking the side videos clicking around and then ended up getting across this one random video titled how to know when you awakened your third eye and I know what you're thinking you're thinking that's a weird title for a video what are you talking about Melissa what the hell this video okay that I just happened to stumble across one random night it was all I needed it did more than just relate to my emotions and my current state and my situation and like I totally related with the video I totally did but it was more than just relatable there was one point in the video when the guy said why don't you just leave if you want to leave go go on an adventure take yourself out go somewhere that you've never been go experience something you've never experienced go do something and go alone and just immerse yourself in it let yourself grow and you'll find out things about yourself when you go out there alone that you never knew about yourself you'll get to know yourself better than you do now you'll find yourself in doing that and he said that if you leave i guarantee you it'll be one of the best decisions you ever made. And that stuck with me. When he told me to just leave, it wasn't like he was just telling me to leave. I already knew I wanted to leave. All it took was somebody to tell me that. I just needed that extra push. I just needed to hear someone else tell me that that's the right thing to do. And so when he said that, my mind started thinking and this thing ticked. This light bulb went off in my head when he said, leave, and that opened doors. I'm not making this video because I think you guys all need to find yourself. That just so happens to be what I had to do. But regardless of whether you need to find find yourself or you have a different path or a different issue that you're facing right now in your life. If I didn't come across that video at that point in time, I would have never felt compelled to open up another tab and start looking into like airlines. How do you take a plane and how much does a plane cost? Because of that video, I got to experience so many things. That video opened doors for me. Not because of the video necessarily, but because I needed that. And I want to give that to somebody who needs that. And that's why I'm making this video. And if I didn't just so happen to, you know, watch it up until like that perfect six minute when he just said that one sentence, that clicked. If I just didn't so happen to do that, I would still be here ten times more lost than I am now. That line was all I needed to think, damn, I need to do something. That's a good idea. He even said so. And I believed him. And he was right. So I'm just making this video simply to pass the message on. I want to do what somebody did for me to somebody else. I want to help somebody the way somebody helped me. A video was all it took for me. Maybe I might just get to a person or two. Maybe I might help a couple people. I just want to pass the vibe on of going through with something that you want to do. Whatever you told yourself that you want to do and strive for it. We all go through life crises. We all go through stressful situations and problems and daily issues that we have to put on, our baggage we have to carry. We all have our own that we deal with all the time. Everybody has their own little struggle, okay? We're all in the same boat though, the boat that's called the struggle boat, regardless of what your struggle is. And it's different for everybody. But personally, I just turned 19 years old and I'm, I'm basically the typical 19 year old girl, scared about her future, worried that she's gonna make it. Where am I gonna be in so many years? Is my future gonna be okay? Like I'm always worried about, am I gonna be okay? How am I gonna survive? Where am I going? What am I I gonna do? I've wasted so much of my time being depressed over the fact that maybe I haven't really been necessarily maybe where I was hoping I would be at this time in my life. Maybe I've let people down or maybe I'm comparing myself to people too much. But that all changed when I saw that video. And during this last year or so, I've just wasted it beating myself up over it. I've 
Forgotten what drives me, what motivates me, what makes me want to do what I want to do. That's important to know. I've been lost. I haven't been myself. I forgot who I was. Not knowing where I'm going and what I'm doing and how I'm not where I want to be and just being upset with the fact that I'm not who I want to be. When I could have been utilizing that time productively, I could have been making progress, but instead I was too busy moping over the fact that I wasn't having it. The point of this video is if I never stumbled across that YouTube video, if I didn't just so happen to watch at that time in my life, on that video, on that day, up until the sixth minute, that one point where he said that one sentence where he said to leave, I would have never looked that up online. I would have still been here in the same rut I've been in for the last year. It didn't take much. Use this time right now to do what you know and you've always known that you've always wanted to do. And don't take it from me, because you have no reason to believe me, right? I'm just a person on a screen. Take it from yourself, because we both know that you've always wanted to do it. Oh, and I almost forgot. Comment below something you've always wanted to do. And if for some crazy reason you guys are still watching this, uh, I just want you guys to know I have a really big in-depth video on the whole Las Vegas shooting thing. And I've been working on this since it happened. I'm hopefully going to have it up soon. I'm going to try my best. And I got some other, you know, other projects too. But like that's the one I'm working on right now, the big one. And I've never really promised in any of my videos, my previous videos, an uploading date. Uh, mainly because I don't make promises I can't keep. I only make a promise if I mean it. So currently, because my life is unstable, my videos are unstable. But I do want to say this just to help motivate me because I do want to do it. Once I have posted the Las Vegas video, once that Las Vegas video is up, after that, I want to always post on Friday. I want to try to post on Friday. If you don't see a video from me on Friday, come back next Friday. I want to try to only upload on Fridays. So you don't have to look any other day. It's not going to be confusing. If you don't see it on Friday, you'll see it next Friday, maybe the next one. But you don't have to keep checking. It'll just be on Friday or no Friday. I'm not going I'm gonna promise I'll have one up because I don't know my life yet. But I'm gonna try my best to post on Fridays. I can't give you a time. I can't give you an exact time, not at all. I mean, it could be 11.59 for all I know. It might not happen until midnight. Who the hell knows? I'm gonna try my best, okay? Not promising anything, but I'm gonna try. So yeah, uh, just have a good day. Go do something. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.